pigs and chickens. Mm -hmm. So we extract water from the river mm -hmm. when water is not around mm -hmm. to, um, to, to use it for our farming purpose. Okay. And we make sure that the, the river area is clean, clean of pollution. No, no one try to pollute it, try to get it clean, etc. Like when the water is not in the pipe, we go around the here and get some spring water and wash. One time it come up in the road here, all along over here. Mm -hmm. I was surprised to know that the river come up in the road here. I want to hear now it come down and flood it out. Mm -hmm. And la the last time it come to reach it, we the mango tree. And the next time maybe it's right up to the step round here. Right up to the step here, but they never come inside of the house. Everything starts to float inside of the house. And when we stand up, stand up, stand up on the bed, the bed starts to float. Oh. We start to float with it. And she now may have to put her up from one place where we make inside of the house. My TV damage, my stove damage. I'm a set the damage. One I time when I get up, the pines are stepping inside of the water. And team if we turn around and do this and do that, find say the door couldn't open. So the water they trap inside. And somebody would have went to come on before there. And three o'clock about in three o'clock it trapped in the morning there. And I went to come on in five o'clock hours. Somebody gonna rescue me outside. Well, the worst one was what, 17, 2017, May 17. Mm -hmm. That's when my experience, the worst one. One was before, but you know, it never so wicked like the one on my experience, 2017. Tell me about the 2017 experience. Well, that one was rough. It's a rough, rough. That's that now. I flood the driver one truck for here, so I don't care going to turn it over. Chuck park, big park, big truck park. The driver come down here, so I turn it over. Mm. Flood out everybody. You understand? Shop me. I always say flood out down to the car, the pan, um, the veranda. I flood out. Car, what is a flood out? House, what is a flood out? Everybody flood out on the mud. Well, if I'm out. Mm -hmm. How were you affected personally? Well, the fact is this, you know, when everybody runs for rescue upstairs and me down here, so I fight water. Mm -hmm. I look at all this gate of water, bend it up, you know. You understand, I fight water because, you know, me have to try to see what I can do in the meantime. There was a lady over there, sorry, to her youth, them, three kids or four kids, two, a twin, and um, about five of them, or six of them. And upon the wall, the wall, the wall, the wall, the wall, the I don't reach up there, I don't know, but then cry myself. Mm -hmm. Yes. One of the little girl now, um, princess, threw her mother, threw her over the fence over there, so stand up because the water come up and it's a shot, you can't hold her. And she just threw her, grab her, put her over here. So. Mm -hmm. I understand. And most of the people I rescue over here, so they don't use so me. All the water actually done by me outside here, so. Because when we try to go this so I have to go inside of the house, I couldn't go in it. Because the water locked the door and locked out, so I made up on the veranda. I remember the flood coming. No one can come so neither go so neither come so you, know. you understand? Mm -hmm. Whosoever inside for them house trapped not their house. Who out, if you stay out. Because when the fire truck come and come out there for a long while, you have to stay up on the hill because them can't come. Until when the water. But the booty about this, you know, when this place are flooded out, you know, and you tell people so the place flood out. If I want to really come and see them, say a liar, I tell. Because as high as the water is, like we will cover the gate, so. In a few minutes, you know, see the water. I just muddy, see, water gone. So it's there. Mm -hmm. And to my knowledge and what me know, right now, water in the river still, the last big rain we have um, last month here. Mm -hmm. the, 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 the river never come over upon land, but it come right up the bank. You understand? I don't know what they do up at the top still, but it look like them. They look at fixing up the still. 
But though the water come down this time, eh? it not come like how it did come. It just come in at the river. It you know, really do not flooding down here, so mm -hmm. this strip. You understand? The bad encounter that we had, you know. And I don't believe I. It's very hard because without any fear or favor, the Alcan backside come beneath. Any time the rain started to fall, and they, they suspect that um, it's going to overflow, they let for the mud water, the, the, the pizer acid in the river, and it kill off the fishes. Them, and we have to be careful how we are using it after. Because when the river come down, them, they let it go in it. And within a day or so after, pure fish dead all on the river bank all about. And the last time I believe the MP took Alcan to court over it. But, That's not a lineage. Right. But we don't know what they put them no, they're, they are uncontrollable. It seems like they are untouchable. Nobody can do nothing to them. Somebody have to monitor them. And that's a wickedness because the other people from down by the district down there, Ken Village and even further in Abagua, they live off the river with the fishing. They, they use the fishing for the source of income or the source of living. And when the fish is dying, you know, you know it's not a place where you gain a lot of employment apart from the United States up there. So nobody don't have no work, nobody don't have anything to do and pass by you usually buy the fish from them. And you know, once the company knew, we say the fish them buy, nobody not, all when they get good one, nobody not buy them. Two weeks ago, when when the heavy rain was falling, as soon as they see the heavy rain and know the flood that will come, they let it go into the river. The mud, the pies mud. Salcan always follow the river, especially when it's rain. Killing the fish, killing pan cleaner and those things. You know, for do some river training. What really makes matters worse, you know. Somebody they come in and track and say they might clear the river down so, right now and corner around so. mm -hmm. And they push up all of the sand and the dirt them and dump it at the corner. And say the tractor broke down and they don't come back. So mm -hmm. look you know. When the water comes, so, the water comes a force from the force, you see? Instead of it have a clean slope for go so you go right in the corner and the bank in the corner because the water comes like a 75 degree or even a 90 degree angle it have to take. So the water jump in the corner down so it's a heat of the land and come up here. So mm. if that was a steady flow, we might not even have that amount of volume. You know see a flooding. But most of everything bank up the sun over and then after I bank up now it take a time now to push straight. Maybe mine not. When you go straight, you go straight. But when you take a corner like a 90 or 70 degree, the water go jump so and then come back so by you. So you know, so it go beep on the side and then it go back so. Mm -hmm. But what really if you take place in river training? You oh. understand? Mm -hmm. I don't know who to call, who to say it or what to do, but it, I mean, you know. Well, you have to be afraid, afraid of rain and, and flooding, you know, because what you know, you know, water more destructive more than fire, you know. Yes, uh, fire and blaze up and cool number water and the mine. Because if water come and push the building and find saying you can't get it there, go on and eat it and lift you up and turn it over. Mm -hmm. You see it? So the fact is this if the politician then I'm not a politician, I'm a politician. And then come and give a bag of argument, this, that, that, that thing going to this and then going to that and went to the end of the day, they don't do nothing. But also have a responsible place if they decide and say they have to fix it. If they fix, 